It is inevitable. These things are irrelevant. You must come and live with us. But we cannot live with you. You're, you're different. You've got no feelings. Feelings? I do not understand that word. Emotions, love, pride, hate, fear. Have you no emotion, sir? Come to Mondas and you will have no need of emotions. You will become like us. Like you? We have freedom from disease, protection against heat and cold, true mastery. Do you prefer to die in misery? But look, surely it, it's possible for us not to lose all its energy. It is inevitable. Then you don't mind if we all die? Why should we mind? Why? Why? Because millions and millions of people are going to suffer and die horribly. We shall not be affected. Don't you think of anything except yourselves? We are equipped to survive. We are only interested in survival. Anything else is of no importance. Your deaths will not affect us. But I can't make you understand. You're condemning us all to die. Have you no heart? No. That is one of the weaknesses that we have removed. <laughs> All right, get me Geneva, quick! Scott Tardis, come in, please. This is Nissa. We're coming back to the Tardis. The hold is crawling with robots. Any of you hurt? No. We got separated from Tegan. If the freighter crashes into Earth with you on board, won't that make it rather difficult for you to carry out your task? I mean, you would be very crumpled. I shall not be on board, Doctor. You don't surprise me. My function was leader of a squad to eliminate those who survived the bomb. Now your transport has replaced the bomb. I shall join the secondary force to complete my task. Are they all so dedicated? Compared to some, this one is positively flippant. have gone. She's dead. Doctor! Patrick! Where did you come from? That thing caught me! Where's Nissa? She's safe, she's in Who the time! Who is this woman? An earthling, no one of consequence. It's a lot. Be quiet. She's one of your crew. In a manner of speaking. I see the Time Lords have emotional feelings. Of sorts. Surely a great weakness in one so powerful. Emotions have their uses. They restrict and curtail the intellect and logic of the mind. They also enhance life. When did you last have the pleasure of smelling a flower, watching a sunset, eating a well-prepared meal? These things are irrelevant. For some people, small, beautiful events is what life is all about. You have affection for this woman? She's a friend. And you do not consider friendship a weakness? I do not. 
kill her. No! Such a reaction is not a disadvantage. You are mistaken. I now have control over you, Doctor. All I need do is threaten the woman's death for you to obey me. Please, get inside the building. We'll find whatever's coming. Activation time, fam! They're close. I don't know how many they are or which direction they're coming from. Quick! Run. Get to your ship. I am sick of running. I want to fight him. It won't be a fight. It'll be a massacre. The drones are just the advance guard. I'll buy you some time. Go. Now! Come on. Best Scott, you and Ravio get the grav rough started. Ethan and I'll grab the supplies. didn't stop them, Doc. I know. They destroyed everything we brought with us. I know. We haven't got anything else to defend ourselves or them. I know! Listen to me. Do not argue. Go with the humans. Help them get them out of here. You won't make it back to the TARDIS alive. Make sure you're with them. What about you? I'll hold them off. How are you gonna do that? This isn't a discussion. We're not just gonna leave you. Yes, you are. You have to, all of you. No questions, get out. I've been so reckless with you. What are you talking about? You're human. If they capture you, they'll convert you. I'll find you. Get safe, now! Don't forget to click below to subscribe to the official Doctor Who YouTube channel.